Hello everybody. I am back. Uh, just want to let you guys know that I'm doing much better. A lot better. Um, the medication really started to kick in and work shortly before that four week mark. And now it's been about two weeks and I'm pretty much back to my old self and I'm thrilled, absolutely thrilled. Um, I still do have a few little bouts here and there with some anxiety or panic, but it's, it's nothing that bad, nothing I can't handle. And so that way I'm doing good. One thing I didn't mention to you guys at the same time I was, um, you know, tr uh, trying to get used to that medication, I was also going twice a week to physical therapy. Um, my lower back gives me a lot of problems. Um, I have my facet joints or facet joints in the lower lumbar region are like wearing away or they're degenerating, whatever. And so um, off and on I get a lot of lower back pain. I'm sure like a lot of you. <coughs> but um, this wasn't for that, although they did help me with that somewhat. Um, I just recently found out that I have um, two different areas of scoliosis. Um, one of them is like in the top of my back between my shoulder blades. So apparently my spine veers to the left and then twists a little bit. And then it does something similar um, lower down. And um, that too gives me, uh, especially between my shoulders, it'll give me pain off and on. And um, sometimes uh, I know if I lift too heavy of things or um, carry things for too long, and that would a lot of the times be the grandkids, um, that's going to give me problems. It's going to give me pain, if not right at the moment, later. But anyhow, um, the physical therapist, lovely, lovely woman, I tried to find out if she was single because I wanted to set my son up with her. <laughs> but uh, he didn't like that idea. So anyways, um, she showed me a lot of things I didn't know about myself, that I walk funny and um, one of my legs is longer than the other, although I kind of, I kind of felt like I knew that based on just, you know, like how my clothing fit and stuff, but I thought it was in my head and she gave me these really good exercises and um, uh, the things that are wrong with my back aren't really fixable. Um, Maybe somewhere way down the road surgery would be an option, but really they don't use it very often unless it's an extreme case or something. And I really don't want back surgery. Anyways, so it didn't cure anything. It did help for a while. Um, I just got to keep up with the exercises she gave me for here at home. And... Um, with my lower back in particular, I end up with a lot of hip pain and um, apparently my hips, especially my left hip, I don't get a lot of uh, range of motion so I got to keep up with that and um, I know a lot of people have gone to physical therapy and didn't like it, but I felt like it was really, really helpful so I want to ask you guys, have you been there? What have you been there for and did you find it helpful? Um, did it relieve some kind of pain? Did it give you, you know, better range of motion? Did it keep you from having surgery? You know, or was it, you know, like a recoup after surgery or something like that? But um, I, I can't say I've, I've only, I've only gone this, you know, one time well, for these weeks. But it's not like, you know, I, I've had other physical therapists for other issues. But, um, I'm having a lot of problems again lately with my lower back, so I think I, I need to do these uh, these exercises a little more frequently than I am. And they're not difficult, you know, it's just forgetting about them, being a little lazy or whatever, you know. Um, 
so it's end of July, early, gonna be early August. What are you guys up to? <laughs> Do anything fun? Go on any vacations? Um, I'm going to German Fest, fun time. Uh, Wisconsin has a lot of church festivals. I went to one of those. I didn't go to Summerfest, and Summerfest was always dubbed the world's biggest music festival. And I don't know if it still is, but it was always one of my favorites. I mean, for like 15, 20 bucks to get in, there's so many different stages and so many different types of music, and by big name stars, not, you know, just your local bands or whatever, although they're there too. And they do have a lot of other um, local people there, uh, you know, entertainers and um, like for the kids they would do stuff like BMX, uh, bikers and skateboarders and there was rides and stuff. But anyhow, I didn't go this year and it kind of blows, but you know, I, I don't go every year, but maybe next year I'll go. Um, state fair is coming up. I don't know if I'll go to that or not. I'd like to. It's just that it's always the first week of August and that's we get so bloody hot and just the thought of walking around in the sun at 90 some degrees with I'm sure a high humidity it just doesn't sound fun to me there are a couple of buildings with air conditioning but as I'm sure you can figure out they're pretty packed but I love going and seeing the animals and seeing especially what the young kids have done with their animals and you know the competitions and the prizes and you know, it's just a good time, and um, if, if I can, maybe I will get there, you know. Um, I don't know what other festivals are out, like we have Greek, we have, no, do we have Greek Fest? I can't remember. We have Festa Italiana, that already happened, I didn't go. Polish Fest, Irish Fest, um, Festa Mexicana, and they have one, I think it's around September, it's, uh, Indian summer, that's really cool. But yeah, there's a lot going on and I live really nearby a huge park and they've been having free concerts in the park. And whether I go there or not, most time I can hear them, so that's really cool. Uh, my son and I have gone over there though a couple of times and um, I don't know, you know, um, it's not real hot right now, so I'm enjoying the weather. It's been uh, cloudy. Um, they thought rain, but probably not till tonight. Um, I'm going to be releasing a garden update video. I tell you, it's a year for gardening, isn't it? You know, it's just really hit and miss. Um, but anyhow, I just wanted to let you guys know, you know, what I was up to and let you know that I'm doing all right. And I hope you guys are too. You know, different seasons bring out different things in people, especially when we're talking ailments and and things that hurt or bother us. So um, I hope you're doing all right. You know, um, if you want to leave down in comments what's been going on with you, sometimes I feel that helps us to unburden ourselves, you know. Maybe other people can help give advice. You just never know. But anyhow, it was nice talking to you guys, and you take care.